everyone welcome back to a new video so in today's video i'm going to be showing you the new colors from nail Kami. these are the genesis acrylic colors um i've mixed them all up but there is an indian summer collection and then there are some individual colors um they're so so pretty uh the names are on the bottom of the tubs the pots this one is really nice it's got like a shimmer for it through it. The first one was Zinnia. That was a really bright green, like a fluorescent -y green. Um, Atlantis is a really gorgeous greeny. I love it. It's really nice. This one is Periwinkle. So this is a nurse blue. Some of them, um, hang on, there is one in particular. Oh, this one is Bluebell. This one is a little bit darker than periwinkle the first one and the next one is nighthawk this is probably my favorite out of the colors that they have released so far it's got a shimmer in it as well it's a really nice one actually this one and, and atlantis have that same kind of shimmer and they're really pigmented colors they're really 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 nice to work with and busy lizzie is i love this one oh look at that color oh i love them um, I'm so excited. I now have Nelkami Genesis colours to play with. Oh, I've been waiting for this for ages. Oh, it feels like ages. Uh, this one is Asta. This one is a marbly one. It does marble. Um, but we, you can work. There are ways to work around it, which I, as I use it, I will, I will explain. Um, so that is Asta. The next one is Freesia. This is a bright fluorescent pink. I love this one too. Look at that colour. Oh, <laughs> I love it. Love it, love it, love it. The next one is called a beard tongue. I know beard tongue. I was like, beard tongue? <laughs> but this is quite a nice colour. I do actually quite like that colour. It's like a pinky, I want to say a pinky red. And then we've got Phoenix. This one is a red, but this again has got like a shimmer in it. Um, I don't think you can see it from that side. I don't know how it picks up on the camera. But again, this is a really, really nice one to work with. It's swatched beautifully. You can see it better there. Um, and then I'm going to show you Poppy, which is another red. Now, this is just a kind of solid red, like with no shimmer. And this one was really nice as well. Really pigmented. A really, really nice one. Perfect name as well. The next one is a really fluorescent orange uh, bee balms. I love saying this one, bee balms. I love its name. I don't know. I love it. I love the colour. Super bright. Oh my days! Look at that. Oh, I love it. Um, and then we've got marigold. This is. I'm, I'm going to say a yellowy orange. Like it would be good for like sunflowers and stuff. And then we have got petunia which i would call an orangey yellow so we've got a yellowy orange and an orangey yellow or, or would you call this a dark yellow i don't know no 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 this is good for sunflowers this one this is good for sunflowers this one not the other one mine about <gasps> and then we've got begonia how bright is this yellow i love this one this is oh i love the brights oh, i love the brights oh look at that color love that and then the next two are amazing. So the first one out of the two, this is as well, this is a 25 gram pot. The other colours are 20 and this is a 25 gram pot and so is the next one. Um, these have got glitter in, but not only that is if you turn it into, look how they glow in the dark. So this one's called ice and the next one is called fire. So ice glows a really bright blue. Uh, fire is similar, but it's got red glitter through it. Oh, my washing up just fell. My tumble dryer's going, but my washing machine's on its spin. Look how pretty that is. And then if we put this one under the lamp, you can see this one. Look, bright orange. How crazy are they? I absolutely love them. Oh, the next two are glittery ones. The first one is Myrmicorn. Um, I was a little bit in two minds about this one because I feel like the glitter should be in a clear acrylic to make it, you know, I just feel like the coloured acrylic kind of dims the glitter a bit. 
Uh, same with this one. Actually, this one is a charity one. So this is for Beautiful Minds. Every time, every time this is purchased, Nail Kami give three pounds seventy five to charity. So this one is well worth getting. Um, this one I don't think I've shown you there. This one actually has been out for a little while. This one is called Iced Blossom. I like this one as well. This one's really pretty. Oh, it's so nice. Look at that. Oh, isn't it gorgeous? And then I thought we could have a quick play around. So I'm going to do um, a marble, um, a gradient, you know, marble, uh, uh, an ombre, and something else. I can't remember. So the first nail I'm going to do is an ombre so I'm going to do like a three-way ombre now I've not this is the very first time that I have played with these acrylics so I'm not entirely sure how they're going to work so this is literally I thought I'd film it because it's going to be like first impressions you know I just feel like it's good I like I could I could try them out and then I could see how they work, and then I could lie about it. Not lie about it, but, oh, what's, what am I trying to say? I just thought I'd, I want you to be here as well when I try them for the first time. So I'm just trying to blend. I'm, I've struggled here, <laughs> as you can tell, but I think I got quite a nice blend in, in the end between the yellow and the orange. Well, it wasn't too bad, anyway, put it that way. And um, I did work with small beads to try and get that ombre nicer the pink that i'm gonna use is the freesia one over bee balms i think yeah i think this was bee balms the orange was bee balms it blended absolutely beautifully it was it was almost like them they're, they're made for each other look isn't that just oh, it reminds me of a lolly actually and um, it, it reminded me of fruit pastel lollies. And I have actually done a set for, <laughs> I, have, I have done a set dedicated to fruit pastel lollies, which I will get up very soon. Um, so that was the marble, not the marble, that was the, the, the ombre. And I thought that was, I loved it. So I'm using Asta, Atlantis and Lily. And I've got to use ice as well. And we're going to do a marble. So, Asta, I, look, it marked. Can you, did you see it marble? But if you roll it on, you get the pigment on the top. Oh, I don't know if I'm explaining this very well. If you roll the bead onto the nail, you get the pigment on the top. And the, the that, because it all depends what the acrylic is, is um, like, mi sorry, not the acrylic. It all depends what the pigment is mixed with as to whether it kind of marbles or not. Um, I will probably use Asta to do marble nails in the future. Um, because I don't know that I... I don't know. I'm not very... Um, I, can't, I don't know what I'm trying to say here. I'll have to try and use Asta to do a solid colour nail. But I'm worried that I won't get... I'll, I'm worried because it is a bit, a bit of a marbler. Um, I'll end up with streaks through it but I mean in this nail it works perfectly doing a marble nail there's, so there's no reason why you couldn't use it in a nail like this do you know what do you know what I'm saying do you know what I'm saying um, I'm using the ice just to add a little bit of glitter through and then here I felt was a little bit plain so I put a little bit of white and a little bit of Asta Asta Manana <laughs> no I put a little bit of um, Asta through the, the top bit there and I'm what I'm doing is I'm working with wet beads and then I am putting my brush, just skimming the top with my brush up and down, you know, kind of diagonally just to create a marble. And I felt that worked really well. I was really pleased with how it looked in the end. So I'm going to leave that like that. I do cap these nails, but I'm not going to show you me capping them. I just wanted you... I just wanted to show you me working with them. And then I couldn't not use Nighthawk. I love it. And I'm going to put Bellamente at the top. So I'm going to put Nighthawk at the bottom. Isn't... Oh, God. This colour is just... Wow. I can't get over how much I love this colour. So I'm putting this at the bottom. I'm going to blend it up a little bit. Oh, it's just so stunning. And then I'm going to take some of the Bellamente 
and I'm going to put that at the top and I'm going to blend that down over the Nighthawk. We're going to do a little bit of a glitter fade. I wanted to show you this one because this is the charity mix. This is for the Beautiful Minds charity. Look at those big circles of pink for it. There we go. So I'm going to cap all of these in clear and then I will file and buff them. And now we're going to use the, see this is, this is them all. I'm going to use the non-white top coat to do a quick top coat in time. And this was the ombre, the three-way ombre. These is so summery colours, these. I love that pink. And I love the orange. And I actually, I love the yellow too. I really like yellow and green at the moment. And then this was the Bellamente nail. I'm going to leave the the marble one to last because actually I think that was my favourite out of all of them. I love the purple at the bottom. Nighthawk. Oh my god, it's so nice. This one I think is my favourite. Actually turned out quite subtle. I think it's because I used the, the white in it, the lily. Look how pretty that is. And I'm going to show you this um, in the dark as well. See, it, actually, it wasn't very good in the, uh, the my dark. It wasn't very dark. That my it be my it wasn't very dark in my bedroom when I done this. But you can still see how bright it is. Is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> so that is all of them. The new colours are available from Nelkami's website. I don't know if Deb, um, the US distributor, has them yet, but I'm sure she will have them very soon. Um, I'll leave a link to her website in the description box, blah, 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 description box below. Thanks for watching. Um, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please leave me a like. If you haven't already, do consider subscribing because a lot of you watch my videos and you're not subscribed, okay? So click that subscribe button. Take a look at Nelkami's website. Oh, look how pretty they are. Oh, so happy with them. So glad I've got colours. Cannot wait for more colours. Whoop, whoop. Anyway, I will see you lovely lot on thursday have a great tuesday wednesday yeah bye